Hey everybody, this is Perch. Uh, what's the problem with image? So I've got this viewer mail here, and the viewer asks, Hey Perch, in your opinion, what is stopping image from expanding the reach beyond the direct market? I feel like image should have a greater presence in bookstores because their titles are easier to get into and have a variety of genres beyond just superhero comics. So why don't we see more of image uh, in titles in bookstores? Are they just trying not to, or is there a lack of interest from the bookstores? Uh, please let me know what you think. Uh, and there's a little extra part here that says, uh, by the way, I know you hate Arby's, but what do you think of White Castle? Uh, that's a, that's a good question. So uh, I, White Castle, so first off, White Castle's quality is all over the map. You, I definitely, and, and maybe it's just the White Castle product itself, depending on how uh, hungover or uh, stoned you are, yeah, you did, the quality wildly varies, <laughs> in your opinion. Um, but I, White, White Castle is pretty inconsistent of uh, food. And, and, but I, I, I mean, White Castle is not um, amazing of a, of a place. It's, but, but their product is more, I guess, uh, straightforward as to what it is. It, it's, it's fairly basic burgers. It's just what, that's what they have. And so from that perspective, it's, it's a little bit harder for them to uh, sink to the depths of, of Arby's, where Arby's tries other things and, and goes horribly, horribly awry. Um, so anyway, I, I, White Castle's fine. I mean, not a place I seek out. Um, I, I'm, I like, uh, there's in and outs down here like those. But, uh, but anyway, there you go. So why does an image go further? Um, it's a good question. It's actually a really good question when you think about uh, you know, Skybound and the current relationship Kirkman has with both a lot of other media outlets and with, you know, Amazon, that image has the door somewhat wide open for them to go more outside the direct market. In addition to that, uh, you're absolutely right. Image does, you know, is kind of preloaded with a bunch of different genres. Certainly image got started with superhero comics, but at this point, you know, it, it, the company has awareness of doing lots of different things. And Image has had a pretty successful track record of getting some of their shows up and out into media in ways that are, that are sticking more. Uh, you know, I, so uh, why, doesn't, why doesn't Image do better? Why doesn't Image go beyond? Well, uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a fascinating question, and there's not, an, there's not a great answer. There's not a clear answer. Uh, there's a lot of speculation. I think, uh, you know, logistically, if I look at Image's operations, I don't think Image has the uh, kind of talent or capacity to go pierce that market right now. I mean, they, they just, they don't have the people, they don't have the necessarily the, uh, you know, people working for the company who has experience going more broadly to the newsstand and doing a true kind of distribution deal in that way. I think it's a, you know, they have comic book people who are used to the comic book way of doing things. Um, Image largely grew up you know, completely from its origin in the direct market. So going wider, uh, they, they don't have the DNA in their company. And that, that's probably the biggest reason why they don't, they haven't done it. Um, the, the question that kind of quickly follows that is, well, why don't they go get it? So the image likes money in theory, right? Well, I mean, I think when you talk to people at image at a higher, at, you know, the higher levels of the company, you don't walk away with the feeling like you've got, uh, you know, you're, you're talking to people who really want to go dominate the comic business. You, you're talking about people who want to carve out their niche and own it. And they're not, they're not bucking to get beyond that. Uh, it's, which, is, which is puzzling, but it's, it's like a company that is satisfied to get where they got. The other aspect of image that I think slows things down or at least creates just enough friction that the company doesn't bother doing more with it is because you know image itself is decentralized in the sense that you have very strong, powerful voices who are doing their own thing. You have Kirkman doing his thing, you have Millar doing his thing, Miller, Miller, uh, doing his thing. You have Todd McFarlane uh, doing it. So you have different people chasing different dreams within image, different ways of doing business, different ways of publishing comics, and you just you don't have a lot of. Uh, you know, I, I, knew, I had a friend there who's since left. Uh, who said that you know ideas like that? You you felt like you had to go through a gauntlet of getting all the powerful players in Image to sign on to your idea, and it just it, it wasn't it wasn't worth it, quite frankly. It was too hard to get everybody on the same page with, hey, we're going to try this new you know distribution idea. Um, this gets into more rumor territory, but another thing that was said was you know there's enough egos at that company that somebody coming in who's like, hey, we're going to change the entire way we sell comics. Let's go. 
uh, it, it, it would immediately be attacked by several of the people. And there'd be questions about who the person was aligned with. Is this guy or woman? Is it, uh, you know, is she coming from the Kirkman camp? Is she coming from, where, where is she coming? Where is this person coming from that would have this great idea? And would the other people kind of naturally either, you know, outright resist or just kind of passively resist? Uh, but I, I think the the simple answer there, and I, I, I don't like the answer, is just there's, there's a belief of we understand the comic business as we know it. That comic business is the direct market. That's what we've grown up on. Uh, we'll ship graphic novels to places like Barnes and Noble and, and so on, but that's pretty much as far as it goes. And, you know, we're not really going to, we're not going to do much else. If you look at image and you look at kind of what they've done over the years, there has been a, you know, there's been easy opportunities to do bundle opportunities, bundle, you know, all kinds of things. Uh, Paper Girls is coming to Netflix. Uh, could you do something in concert with, you know, Netflix has these pop-up stores right now for Stranger Things and some of their other properties. Could you do something like that? Well, the comics rarely seem to get there or never. Um, if you, you know, you, you look at what uh, Miller has done with Netflix, you know, you, you heard the interview with Miller. He's, he's pushing a lot of his own initiatives. But wouldn't you think somebody in Image would go, hey, with kind of the bigger names, the higher profile people we have, we are actually a company that's produced comics that have made it into shows that are heavily promoted. Uh, there's an opportunity there to, to go to a Target or to a Walmart or to, you know, a grocery store and say, hey, let's put something out. Um, I think the other, one other little thing it's worth kind of throwing in there, I guess, is that part of going to the newsstand and going wide with distribution means you do have to tackle the is it all ages or is it not problem. And Invincible, if you were to put that comic in a grocery store, you know, it, the, the, the blood and the violence, and the other content that was included in there would quickly get just, you know, it, 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 it couldn't be sold there. And Image has a lot of more adult content. Um, not not all of it, of course, but a lot of it pushes uh, higher up it, to the even like look when Spawn first came out, this is the '90s. Uh, there were there were a decent amount of I think uh, religious groups who would claim that that was uh, you know encouraging Satanism and other things. And even today, if if you tried to throw Spawn out in the newsstand, you'd have issues, and and some stores just wouldn't carry it by nature of this kind of feeling like it's it's horror ish. And so that's, that's the problem that you've got. Uh, it, to, go, to go wide, to go you know, far with distribution, you've got to have a product that typically is you know, homogenized enough, or at least you know, if there's moments, and, and this is maybe more of a perception thing than anything else, but Image just has that, that vibe of being a little bit, I mean, it, look, Invincible as a comic, uh, it, you know, it didn't have violence for... I, I don't know, two thirds of the issues. I, I don't know. It, or it, it would have it, but not the, the gory over the top stuff that would cause issues if you were putting it into a Kroger or a Safeway. So anyway, but there, there you go. So that's, that's my answer. I don't know if that's a satisfying answer. I, it, it is one of those cases where I, you know, I wish they would, or at least figure out their outlet. Um, you know, I think that, well, here, so as a prediction, I think over the next 10 years, um, somebody within comics, some enterprising either content creator or distributor or publisher, somebody is going to identify and figure out what the new newsstand is. Because the newsstand that we grew up with in the 80s is gone. It's changed. Uh, one of the biggest sellers, the two biggest kind of places to sell comics in the days of the newsstand was the grocery store and the gas station. And today the gas station is you know, infrequently attended. Pay at the pump is done away with a lot of the purchases there. People still go in, but you know, kids aren't just wandering in there. And just kind of the entire nature around kids in general, they're not, you know, left to their own devices inside of a grocery store while mom shops. That's that just those days are largely done. So, you know, what is the new newsstand? It's out there, there's stores everywhere. So how do you get into it? What's the model? I think somebody is going to crack that and it would make sense if it was image. I think they have a lot of the pieces in place that they could do it, but you know, I, there are some, there are some blocks. Anyway, thank you very much for the question. Let me know your theories in the comments below and thanks for listening.